We are doing health now, and we are talking about neglected tropical diseases. And we are focusing this morning heavily on river blindness. Now, onchocerciasis, which of course we know it as uh, river blindness, is caused by the parasitic worm known as Onchocerca volvulus, and it is transmitted to humans through exposure to repeated bites of infected black flies of the genus Simulium. And we've been joined in studio by Dr. Benjamin Marfo, who is the program's manager of neglected tropical diseases in Ghana. Thanks for joining us, sir. Let's talk a bit about the uh, neglected tropical diseases in Ghana. Okay, thank you very much. Um, Basically, neglected tropical diseases are a group of uh, infectious and parasitic diseases f found worldwide. And most of them, they are found in very poor communities, mm. very, very poor communities. They are severely debilitating and disabling. Uh, like I said, they are, they are endemic in poor communities. And uh, they promote poverty and intense stigma. You can find them also in urban slums. Or remote rural areas. But why is that? Time. Why are they mostly found, you know, in these slums and poor areas? Yes. Yeah, so, for instance, uh, 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 if you take, let's say, elephantiasis, mm. for instance, mm. um, you find the disease in uh, very poor areas, mm -hmm. as, I, as I indicated, persons with low immunity. Uh, some some of them are even uh, malnourished. Right. Yes. And then uh, when you get when they get exposed to the bites of um, the mosquito, mm. the female anopheles mosquito, and they, they could be infected. That is, if the female anopheles mosquito has the, the worm right. called uh, Wachereira bancrofti. Now, yes. Doc, let's turn our attention to river blindness, onchocerciasis. Yes. Tell us a bit about it. Yes, so onchocerciasis um, basically is caused by also by a worm mm. uh, called the onchocerca volvulus, transmitted through the bites of uh, the black fly. Mm. You find black flies along rapids. When I talk about rapids, I'm talking about fast flowing rivers. Right. Yes. So when they bite and they are infected, uh, flies are infected. They they may transmit uh, the the infection to uh, another person. So the um, the clinical manifestations you have rashes, uh, severe itching, Just and there's the yes, symptoms. and you find disfigurement of the of the skin. Mm. The skin becomes very hard, typically called the lizard skin. Right. We have the hypopigmented patches, mm. what is popularly called um, leopard skin. Ultimately, the patient uh, gets blind. So it, can it be treated or when you are blind, that's it? Oh, when you are blind, then it becomes, it, it, it becomes a challenge. I mean, yes. But in the initial uh, stage, mm. yes, it can. It can be treated. Yes, it can. Yeah. But is there a way to prevent it? Yeah, so for instance, I want to talk about uh, river blindness. So not getting bitten by the black fly mm. is important. So, so it's you, just a black fly yes. that causes yes. river blindness. Yes, so the black fly, yes, in terms of transmission, that's the vector. Right. Yes, but if the black fly has the worm mm. and it bites you, it can uh, uh, transmit uh, the infection uh, to you. And as I said, uh, it, it affects the skin. Uh, you may even have swelling over the skin, what, mm. what is popularly called in medical balance, noodles. Mm -hmm. Yes, ultimately uh, it affects uh, the, the eyes and you get blind. Before we move on to the program that you are organizing to yes. prevent some of these things, let's talk a bit about elephantiasis because it is part of uh, the neglected mm. tropical yeah, yeah, diseases. Yeah, right. Yeah, yes. yeah, right. So elephantiasis, uh, as I indicated, is also caused by a worm mm. called Wichereria bancrofti. Right. A very tiny worm, mm. a microfilaria worm. You can't see by the, by the eyes. Um, and, um, as, and it's also transmitted, not, uh, you know, the black fly. No, no, the black fly is for, for uh, the river blindness, right. but for um, elephant We're talking about this, our, 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 uh, the mosquito, the mm. female anopheles mm. mosquito that, caught, that transmits uh, uh, malaria. Right. So the same. Yes, so you have the worm. Uh, if the, uh, the the mosquito bites you, it could transmit the worm to you, and the worm could uh, affects. We have another system called the lymphatic system, which plays a major role in terms of uh, fluid balance and uh, in, in immune response. 
And so in doing that, there's water uh, fluid accumulation in parts of your body. Mm. It could be the legs, the arms, the breasts, the genitals, in any other places. So yeah. that's why sometimes you see some of them. When it gets to the, um, uh, the leg stage, mm. that's when, that's when we, call, we, we normally call that elephantiasis, because the, leg the, leg, the legs take the shape of uh, the legs of an elephant. Uh, you mentioned earlier that some areas in Ghana are infected yes. uh, largely by uh, these black flies, and so yes, there's right. lots of river blindness. Which, yeah. which areas? So are for so for let, let, let's talk about the ten traditional regions. Right. Um, we find um, uh, elephantiasis mm -hmm. endemic in eight out of the ten. Eight out of ten, ten regions. Ten. So elephantiasis is endemic in all the regions except Ashanti region and the uh, water region. Mm. When we talk about river blindness, river blindness is also endemic in all regions except Greater Accra. Right. Now for this exercise, Greater Accra is not endemic for uh, um, uh, river blindness, mm. but we've broken transmission of elephantiasis in Greater Accra since 2014. So for this exercise, uh, we, we, uh, we are not doing mass drug administration in Greater Accra. So now uh, that there's so 16 we'll be regions, yeah. uh, do you hope to go to the we, we, yeah, so, research yeah, in, in yeah, so we, well? Yes, so we Yes, we've done that. So we've, we'll be doing mass drug admission in 15 out of the 16, aside Greater Accra. Right. Yes. Now let's talk about the program, what the organization is doing yes. about neglected tropical diseases in Ghana. Yes. So we have three main strategies for the program. Right. Talking about the mass drug administration, where annually we move into communities, we move into district schools, and we give drugs. Mm -hmm. The drugs uh, kill, literally kill, the developing uh, worms. I mean, the young worms, Are these the drugs green worms. For free? Yes, they are for free. Right. They are for free, but we're for free for us. But somewhere, somebody's paying for that. Oh. Yes. Yes. So. Uh, I still can't see. Yeah. So but they, are, they are for free, and then they are they are also safe mm. and quite potent. They kill the uh, the worms, the young worms. So mm. the young worms wouldn't grow to become adult worms and and reproduce more of the worms. So that, that, that is what is happening. And then, so that's the first uh, strategy. Right. That's the mass drug administration. And then we have the second strategy, what, that, what we call the mobility management and control, whereby we make sure that those who have the disease, if they, if they come to the health facilities, we should be able to uh, manage so mm -hmm. that they don't suffer. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we have a way of managing pe people who have uh, swollen legs, so that at least they're able to uh, carry out their normal uh, activities. And then we have the health education. So these are the three strategies that we're, we're When employed. is this starting? When is the yes, drug we, administration? Yes, the Barasa drug administration started last week. Right. Three regions are already on board. Mm -hmm. uh, talking about um, Ashanti region, Brown and Half Four, and uh, Upper East. Uh, the other regions will follow suit uh, by, by close of the week. And education, uh, how do you hope yes, to Yes, so we do education. In fact, what we are doing is also part of the case education. Mm. So we, 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 uh, in the various communities and districts, we have community debits. Uh, we have the FM, local FM stations that right. we use. And then uh, we make use of the radio stations. We also send messages through the churches, mosques. Yes, and then uh, so people are able to appreciate what the program is all about. So your final words uh, to everybody so out there. So my final word is that uh, mass drug administration mm -hmm. is very good. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, it's important that we all participate. Right. Yes, it's for, it's for all persons, uh, except a, a few, of course. We have uh, the non-eligible. Uh, but so we are just asking that we all participate mm. actively so that together we'll be able to eliminate this disease. This, this, from the country. Thank you very much, Doctor, most, for most coming. Welcome. Dr. Benjamin Mafo is the program's manager of neglected tropical diseases in Ghana, and they're starting uh, an awareness to make sure that all of these diseases are wiped off of uh, Ghana for us. So we all have to participate. We